Today, we will talk about a red wig. What did I do wrong? What were my mistakes? Will I quit trading? And some trade recaps. We'll talk about everything and see if we can improve ourselves. If you're ready, let's start. Okay friends, let's talk. I have been having a killer winning streak in recent months. As you can see a linear growth in my account. However, as you can also see right here last week, I got this poor trading performance. And I have tried to analyze what I did wrong in recent days. It is very important to analyze your performance and spot the mistakes. First of all, I was averaging one good trade a day. I was patiently waiting for a good setup, maybe two at max, if I only can see something really clear. However, last week I definitely overtraded up to four trades a day. I was winning and losing. It was like my trades were battling each other. Probably the main mistake was trading from my phone. Whenever I do this, my performance is so poor. So it was a public holiday. I was mostly visiting friends and family, but back in my mind, trying to trade from my phone while I was chatting with others. Horrible mistake. Lastly, I did some revenge trading. I tried to recover some losses. I think this is all because of my social presence. Once you are in the social arena, you feel this crazy pressure on your back for your community, forcing yourself to keep winning, which generally backfires on you. What was the lesson here? First of all, trading is one of the hardest professions out there. It is really hard and challenging. If you lose your focus for one moment, for one second, one little mistake can create a chain of events and you can lose the account. It is that fragile. Lastly, greed, hope, revenge are the biggest enemy of traders. Basically, your biggest enemy is again you. Yes, right. You are the biggest enemy of yourself when it comes to trading. I do not have time to cover every single trade, but I will try to cover 4 or 5 of them so you can get the ideas about setups and results. Actually, my week started perfectly. I got the runner with the first trade of the week, JTO. JTO was in the top runners list, having this extremely bullish flow upwards. It kept pushing itself upwards. I took this trade around this area. Let's take a closer look in one minute. I have noticed the last push with imbalance and break right here. Later on, price pulled back into this imbalance area, which supported with one minute order block. I also noticed this imbalance fails here. Beside all this, this was a line of previous month high, basic amplifier for our trades. From the discount area, I made the entry. Very, very simple trade to make. And this trade ran like crazy from my entry. It was a straight 7% move from my entry point. First trade was the runner. Sign of a great week, yeah? Not so much. Then things started to collapse. First of all, I could not see great setups. I kind of forced myself to enter trades. I have noticed that FTM keeps pushing itself upwards. Right at this point, I have marked my structure box for the best possible entry point. At the bottom, we had our protected low. So this imbalance was the point I start to seek entry. Let's drop to the five minute chart and talk more. Once I have noticed the gathering liquidity at top, I was very convinced this pair was going to go up. And I made the entry right here like this. I did not wait for extremely low time frame signs 
to enter such as micro MSP. This is a mistake. Once I saw the price was coming to my stop fast, I directly cut the trade. I tried to save my 50% from the full loss. As you can see, this trade actually worked, but I had to manage the risk here. Now, this would be a better entry type in my opinion, seeing a structure shift and entering from this large imbalance area. However, I am sure that I could have cut the trade again around this area. So, I had the right bias, but not perfect entries. Yet another day, I noticed POWR was in the top gainer, so I quickly checked the coin. It was in a very strong upflow, so I tried to join the party. Right around this area, I started to seek entry. If you notice, all pairs actually keep doing the same thing. It keeps making new highs, while it is protecting its lows. Very very simple order flow and structure boxing. Let's drop to the 1 minute time frame. Basically, from this imbalanced area, I started to seek entry. Right here, you can see the microstructure shift with micro imbalance. That was the point of my entry. This trade was going really great actually. I was sure we were going to take the top. But at some point, it turned back so fast. So again, I did the same thing. I cut the trade early, before the full loss. I wanted to save money. Yet again, the trade actually worked, but I suddenly became a paper hand and not able to hold the trade. Well, it is a form of risk management. I have to manage my risks. Let's cover another loss, this time a full loss. I had high hopes for the magic. Again, you can notice the, a very strong upflow of a classic. Right around here, I started to search for entries. Once we had our upwards break, our structure box came to life with a possible protected low. I have noticed this order block area with the imbalance. Then I noticed this microstructure shift with imbalance. Then I decided to try this trade. I did not focus on the trade, I just sent the stop and left. Once I came, it was a full loss, not much else to do. So, what do you think? A red week for me. Shall I quit trading? Because I had a red week? Not really. This is the essence of trading, the reality of trading. No one in the world keeps winning again and again. That is only a dream. Okay folks, take good care of yourself, I'm taking a break until next week. Have a nice day. If you have completed the free trading course and feel like you improved your trading skills, but you need more, an extra, a boost, and you want to move to the next level in your trading life, my master class is ready for you. You'll learn liquidity, inefficiencies and structure mastery deeply. And we will look at forward and reverse trading with momentum super boxes. You will learn how to confirm your entries with magic alignment system. Finally, you'll discover a strategy called yo-yo strategy, which will open new doors for you about taking and managing trades. If you are interested, you can find links on my website on the description. Take care friends, manage your risks and stay safe.